fruit acidity how to calculate the fruit acidity here we have taken amla juice the sample is amla juice we have taken 0.5 grams that means 0.5 ml of amla juice pure juice we have taken we have taken sodium hydroxide the strength of the sodium hydroxide is 0.1 normal here we have taken 0.5 ml of sample solution volume of the sample solution used for the titration is 0.5 ml we have not diluted the solution directly we have taken 0.5 ml of solution we got titration value 2.15 ml of sodium hydroxide then i will tell how to calculate fruit acidity of the amla juice fruit acidity now we get to titration value acidity in the sample um, we want to calculate now titration value with uh, sodium hydroxide is 2.15 ml so acidity in the sample is equal to titration value in ml into normality of the sodium hydroxide here normality of the sodium hydroxide is equal to 0.51 therefore here acidity in the sample will come in terms of milli equivalents therefore acidity in the sample is equal 2.15 into 0.1 milli equivalents acidity in the sample is equal 2.15 into 0.1 milli equivalents that is equal 0.215 milli equivalents for 0.5 ml or 0.5 grams of sample therefore 1 ml of juice contains acidity equal to 0.215 milli equivalents by 0.5 ml that is equal 0.43 milli equivalents now it is uh, acidity is in milli equivalents therefore that value equals to 0.43 into 70 mg of citric acid that is called 30.1 mg of citric acid here we converted uh, milli equivalents to mg of citric acid here 1 milli equivalent of acidity equal to 70 mg of citric acid if at all if we are calculating to malic acid we have to multiply this milli equivalents with 67 mg if we want to calculate in oxalic acid we have to multiply with 45 if we want to calculate in terms of tartaric acid we have to multiply with 75 mg if we want to calculate in, in terms of sulfuric acid we have to multiply this figure with 49 mg if you want to calculate in, in terms of acetic acid you have to multiply this with 60 mg otherwise if we want to calculate in terms of lactic acid you have to multiply milli equivalents in with uh, 90 mg so therefore here we want to estimate in terms of citric acid so we multiplied this milli equivalents with 70 so finally here for each ml 30.1 mg of citric acid we observed now we calculated in terms of citric acid for each ml here one thing i want to say here molecular formula of citric acid is c6h8o7 h2o this is monohydrate form of citric acid so molecular formula of citric acid equal to 210.14 grams in round figure it is 210 grams but citric acid is tri basic therefore its equivalent weight 210 by 3 that is equal 70 grams so we are multiplying milli equivalents with 70 in order to get in terms of milligrams so one milli equivalent weight of citric acid is called 70 milligrams this how the 70 mg came for each milli equivalent of acidity means we calculated based on the molecular formula of citric acid and its equivalent weight this is the reason one milli equivalent weight of citric acid is equal to 70 mg now for each ml of amla juice we calculated acidity 1 ml of amla juice contains acid in terms of citric acid equal to 30.1 mg therefore 1 ml of 
amla juice contains acid in terms of citric acid equal to in terms of grams grams it should be divided by 1000 therefore that value equal to 0 0.0301 grams now we calculate for each ml of amla juice now we will calculate for 100 ml grams per 100 ml how many grams of uh, citric acid is there for 100 ml of amla juice therefore 100 ml of amla juice contains acid in terms of citric acid equal to 0 0.0301 grams into 100 that is equal 3.01 gram therefore acid percent in amla juice equal to 3.01 in terms of monohydrate citric acid so in this way we have to calculate acid percent on citric acid basis monohydrate form of citric acid basis we are calculating acid in terms of percentage acid here acid percent of amla juice equal to 3.01 means 3.01 grams of monohydrate citric acid is present for each 100 ml of amla juice 